He loves and welcome back to the channel. So you're currently on the trains would be Umalo Moshebe and his people from Elimbobo are saying enough is enough. This is not the time to be judging Umalo Moshebe. As we all know, guys, he's still hospitalized and even after he uh, was allowed by the hospital to attend his only daughter's funeral, he was not allowed to go to the burial site before it. He was only there for a few minutes and then he went back to hospital. So they are saying enough is enough. He has received so much judgment and backlash that no human being deserves this type of punishment no matter their shortcomings and that this awful behavior needs to come to an end saying mean things like you know she is paying for his sins for being mean to fans for kicking fans while he was on stage and some were even coming forward to testify against him of how rude he was when they once met you guys and i think the worst accusation i have seen thus far would be the blood sacrifice accusation people saying that he went and joined the Illuminati, you guys. Now, of course, this stems from the fact that Umalu Moshebe has face tattoos and the recent tattoo that he has is of the pyramid sign there on his forehead. And I think if you grew up watching these Illuminati American videos, you would know uh, what they are talking about, um, uh, that, you know, it's it's called the all-seeing eye, something along those lines, all-seeing eye. And in most cases, American celebrities would throw such signs if they are part of such cult. So they are stating that shame man, he probably uh, went to join the Illuminati, it's something that we as South African call Ugutwala and they are basically of the view that although it may not have been his intention lose him losing his child he perhaps failed um, to listen carefully to the instructions and rules which then led him uh, to actually be where he is now hospitalized and without his daughter he tempted the devil to tempt him by number one by having the pyramid tattoo on his forehead and that one provoked the occult of the industry, especially as an upcoming musician. That is why I can tell you that I'm 100% sure that now they are looking for him and they have contacted him to join them. Because by having that pyramid, that is a symbol of the occult of the industry. But one thing that he also made was to put it on his forehead where they believe that that is where you are enlightened because that is why at the middle of the pyramid they put on the eye and that eye they believe it is the eye that is on the forehead the third eye that you can see and that is the eye that you used to see and he put on that pyramid on the forehead where there is an illumination as they would say where they believe that that is where you are being illuminated so when he put that pyramid on his forehead believe you me he was declaring himself as one of them now although he might have not done it intentionally so but i am sure that he knew what he was doing now, he intended himself by provoking that the industry, the occult of the industry. But one thing is that I'm sure that he, he doesn't want to join them and he is not comfortable with what they offer. 
So now that's why it becomes so dangerous for him. Because as an upcoming artist, guys, you must be careful of the, the tattoos that you make. Because those tattoos that you make, they can attract unnecessary attacks against you. Believe you me. Especially if you know that you are not even a spiritual backup. They can attract unnecessary battles and spiritual uh, battles against you that you, you are not even ready or prepared for. Sure, guys. Life really is spiritual. Now, he further goes on to explain that um, he tempted the devil, as he says, but... Uh, does clarify this video was taken way back in february he actually does clarify the fact that he himself umalo moshebe does not want to join uh, the occult however because he's not spiritually fit uh, these attacks that have been happening to him from the beginning of the year will happen until he surrenders or until uh, these attacks actually finish him off you guys that he is either going to be framed of crimes that he never committed or he will be tormented until his career comes to an end what he needs to do is to uh, give his soul to Christ. He needs to be born again so that all these things that had that he has been um, inviting Mpiloniake through um, isn't okay as a Zoba PM Zimbeni Waki. Now, I did see Malumo Shebe on one of the videos that have been trending that he himself said it with his own mouth. Oguti, you know what? I would rather die then sell my soul to the devil. It's something uh, that he uh, never wanted to do. So I do believe the man of God speaking here, he refused to join um, the occult. But at the same time, why are you drawing the pyramid on your face, knowing very well that it is associated with the dark world, the underworld, you know? So this is something that has really been confusing me a lot, Guti. Why would you do that uh, to yourself? But before I go, guys, I just want to give you a brief summary of what the woman and the man in the first video clip are saying. Uh, those Amalumushebe's people, Limbobo people, and they are basically stating that, you know, what we are siding with Umaru Moshebe irrespective of the noise and the accusation because we Tina Esmaziyo we don't understand why you hate him and his family so much this man is only trying uh, to provide he is a provider uh, to provide for his family and here you are holding little meetings to destroy the poor guy although he is trying you literally took something so precious something that he loved the most his daughter now of course some people may come and argue that uh -uh, you can't be blaming um people noktagati and all these things and the devil umalo mushebe has to also take accountability for being reckless drinking and driving speeding on the road that sometimes it's got nothing to do with witchcraft she further goes on to say that if i was able to dance i would dance not because you know i'm happy uh, for the funeral but because i'm so happy of the support that you guys have been giving a umalo Moshebe, especially people from his hood you guys and then they went on uh, to state that may the family uh, be strengthened by a god you guys so yeah these are the news of the hour please share with me your thoughts down on the comments like the video and i will surely see you guys on my next one bye